Talk about another very common shoulder problem, a slap injury, superior, labral, anterior, posterior, the acronym SLAP. How to test for it? Let's take an injured right shoulder and compare it to a non-injured left shoulder and see how we define a slap. Let's look at active range of motion again. Look what happens, full active abduction, but when she comes down to that 90 degrees, that slap lesion catches. It pops, and until she wiggles it around and uncatches it, the shoulder won't go down. Here a very typical maneuver for a patient with a right slap lesion. Just like any of the other shoulder maneuvers, there's a provocative test where you try to catch the torn labral lip inside a maneuver. And it's very similar to what we saw before in impingement syndrome. By crossing the arm in front of you, elevating and internally rotating, you try and catch the slap lesion until the patient says, ouch, and that's a positive maneuver. The real diagnosis comes with arthroscopic evaluation, but these are the physical exam maneuvers that you should do in your office. These physical exam maneuvers will help you and Texas Mutual define the extent of injury, but you have to document that in every one of your clinical notes. Be sure to document the positives and the negatives of your physical exam findings. Thanks for watching Workplace Diagnosis.